three, two, one, go! They say everything's bigger in Texas, and the steel stingers of Lincoln High School have come a long way for their big moment with the big robot they designed and built. Less than a year ago, the team members started creating this 125-pound machine made of aluminum, steel, plastic, wires, and zip ties, and a battery-operated motor. They are San Diego County's only rookie team. At the first robotics world championships here in Houston, there are more than 600 of the best high school robotics teams in the world at this international competition. They're from 50 countries. The boys and girls from Southeast San Diego are grateful to be representing and collaborating. My responsibility here is to kind of coach uh, our driver and controller about what's going on in the game so that they can stay focused on driving the robot and I can focus on the strategy and making sure everything goes right. 94.52, the LHS Steel Stingers lining up up high there. Things did go right in the first match of the morning as the Stingers and their other Alliance team members won. Match two hit a bump in the road with a head-on collision and a torn cable, leaving them out of power, but not out of hope. Okay. We touch the wire again, we're good to go. What are you feeling? Uh, I'm pretty relaxed, yeah, nothing. It's a small, minor problem we can fix right now. First is an acronym that stands for Inspiration and Recognition of Science and Technology, F-I-R-S-T. But the mission here is much more than just promoting STEM education and careers. It's about creating community, too. Oh, for going autonomous. The Oceanside High School Wild Raccoons are also in the competition, and the Petrobots from Patrick Henry are an established team that has competed since 2017. Their team president is a young woman who carries a commitment to continue including more girls in the STEM community. It has allowed us to broaden who's on our team, and it has allowed me to feel more confident because when I first joined, there was only four girls on the team, and now there's 10. Among the 50,000 students, mentors, support staff, and family members who have traveled to compete, there is a diversity and inclusion that is intentional. It's beautiful to be able to see students from different countries working together, different languages, being able to communicate just by understanding that what unites us is the robot. The Lincoln Steel Stingers are also enjoying the ride. This is a learning experience for us. We're here to compete and do the best that we can. Um, I always say if you give it your all and you left and you know you give it your all, win or lose, right, that's all you can do. In Houston, MG Perez, KPBS News.